Hello and welcome back to my Craft the World Let's Play series, where I believe we are picking up exactly from where we left off in the last episode, right after the monster wave. Um, all except that I ordered some more coal to be made because we can now make some more mithril ingots, which is perfect. We're going to make as many of those as we can. If we take a look at the tech tree, load up. Go all the way to the end. The only one we are missing is Master Armor. And we need some Mithril ingots in order to do that, of course. So, yeah, that's going to take a while. Now, I do want to see Grant's shop. What's his price? Ooh, okay. Not going to do that. <laughs> um, that's expensive. Uh, we do need to cut down some more trees, though because we are running low on wood because I'm using a lot of it on coal. So just cut everything down. There we go. It should be good. Um, this still stands from the last muscle wave, though we do need to replace a few traps. I do believe either I have some or we can... Oh, I already have some. I guess we can make four more just to have put there. Yeah, we can add four more, so there for sure. Um, but yes, I do believe... Oh yes, I was mining down here, I forgot. Um, there we go. In the last episode, we also upgraded all the weaponry to be, um, to be a bit more upgraded and up to date with what we need to have. So it is the highest tier. Now it, I'm just digging over here to see if we can find some more mithril over here in this area. Um, hopefully a dwarf or two will come down and take care of that while the others are cutting wood. And also, um, yeah, while they are cutting wood and making coal and stuff. Oh yes, perfect. So I could use with a tool upgrade, but I really just want to focus on the armor so we can protect our dwarves against all these monsters up here when we have to take those on then it would be really nice to have the extra protection and not really the tools because being to be honest we can't live with it so it's not too bad yet uh, I do see mithril over here but it goes deep down and I believe ends in lava at the end let's take a look there we go magic light Wait, not that. <laughs> yep, lava. We do not want to land in that. I believe if a dwarf falls down there, it's dead. So, yeah. We do not want that to happen. Um, so, yeah, I'm just going a bit up here since... I just want to cover this entire area over here. Just to make sure. Also, we got a nice little room here. I don't know if these chests in these um, in these rooms, if I can find one now... Um, these, if they contain like treasure, mithril, armor, anything like that, I guess we'll have to see. Oh, there's actually one there. I'm guessing this might be the first one that we take on just because it's right next door, but this one is easier to to attack. It does not have a big, um, big one of those big zombie elves, I believe, looking at the hair and the ear. Um, only this beholder and this robot thingy that I do not know what is. But we do have a chest here. And a door that I'm not too interested in opening. Actually, I'm interested in opening it because I want to see what it is. But we'll have to see what happens once we get to that. Um, no mithril whatsoever. Yay. Okay, how much do we have right now? We have seven and... Oh. Okay, one mithril ore. We cannot make more than seven. Let's at least try and make one set of armor, which we can right now, or a chest plate at least. So some gold and one piece of coal makes one chest plate. And I do believe that leaves us with three. So that's just enough for a helmet as well. So I guess we'll make that. So that's for, that's almost for one dwarf. We just need a few more ingots of this stuff. Keep going. And hopefully, we'll be good. 
we should be able to see up here as well actually I want, I want to go over those crystals because we don't really want them right now I don't want them right now don't really need them for anything and yeah, it's just taking way longer to to mine so might as well we are very close to a third dwarf as well which is amazing uh, I think when he jumps up here we will be able to see it uh, almost but no no mithril over there though we do have a cave we do have a cave that we have to be very careful about please don't let it be okay not what I wanted to do um, okay, just wanted to make sure that it wasn't goblins attacking or something, but it does not seem like it. Um, but yes, this cave looks very dangerous, so I actually want to straight away um, dig up and away from that. Uh, let's see, if they dig that, they will be able to climb their way. But I know I'm taking a very big, well, <laughs> um, avoiding this down here, but I really don't want to lose, lose a dwarf. We haven't lost one yet, and I want it to stay that way. I guess I can kind of actually save some time doing this. Though it is costing me a lot of mana. But it's almost worth it because it pretty much shows me ooh an egg we are able to get that I'm just not sure what we should use it for or can use it for okay so there's basically no mithril whatsoever actually remaining on the map except for pieces like this that are either too dangerous to get or heavily guarded um, let's see, mana potions, <laughs> mana potions, is that craftable, yes, craft as many as you can, because we will need it, um, yeah, just grab this, we do not need this anymore, so that's a big issue, actually, that means we will have to buy mithril, which I'm not, wait a second, this area is not fully, um, Excavated. Also, they are a bit up here, so I guess maybe a portal here leading over there. Maybe. We also got this section here that isn't um, searched. Also, there's one over there. In fact, I believe. No. I need some more mana so I can get some portals going just to speed things up. Um, we only have one mithril. Yeah, I cannot make that one mithril ingot. Um, and also I cannot make a portal, so they would have to climb all the way down here. Just to do it. Hmm. Yeah, I guess we will have to do that. How would they get down here, though? Um. I guess they would... Travel... I'm not sure where, to be honest. Not even this is leading down to it. <laughs> Must have gone, gone down there by portal. So I guess that makes sense. Okay, but we are going to excavate this area here. At least leading up to here. Somehow. So we can get... What are these? Like smoke trails. You see them? Right here. That's weird. That was just a zombie. <laughs> and he's gonna go get that now. Hopefully he will... Okay, maybe he's not. I just don't want any dwarf to drown. Um, yeah. Okay, where's this guy? It's just that zombie. I just don't want any goblins to attack right now. Don't cut that. Go around it, please. I uh, don't think there's anything here, but we might as well continue because I can't see here. And just to continue over here, maybe, I guess. Yeah. I think I'm going to cut out and then cut right back. 
okay, might as well cut them out. Um, and then cut back once I know some more stuff, so stay tuned. Okay, not much has happened, but I did realize that we could equip our archers with archer's glove, which will increase their archer ability quite a bit if we just uh, take that away. As you can see, that drops a lot, but if we take it on, it increases a lot. So I just made a few. They're not too expensive. Some don't know why it goes there, though. Should go there. There we go. So there and there i don't really know if it matters where it goes but let's just double check that every every archer has one yes they do okay good um i guess we're still here so it's not that far <laughs> to be honest but um not i don't see much i can now create a portal so i I think I'm going to make one over here, just to get to this bit of the map. I think dig through here, get this one and then dig through there, so make this one. There we go, go this far, and then also go down here and get that one, just so we can at least... Um, Oh, how did that happen? He can't have carried it, can he? Sorry if you hear background noise, by the way. I guess maybe that will have... What on earth is happening with the lights now? Okay, that's weird. Um, I just did weird things on the screen. Let's just continue three in this way, but we got some bit through. I don't know if it's from killing these guys or letting them loose or what on earth just happened there. But I guess we'll see... Okay, so we're getting that. If that's the case, kill them all. <laughs> okay, so we continue that way. Get that mithril. We need it. We need the mithril. Okay, so this is the edge. I believe the I guess the ocean will be over here and then maybe it'll be like here or so. I don't know. We'll see once we get there. Okay. Got the mithril, nice. We got some gold, which actually we do need as well. So he's killing that. That did drop mithril as well. <gasps> we got a new dwarf. Leather armor, are you serious? Okay, but we got a new dwarf, which is perfect. Let's meet our new fella. There we go. His name is Rin. Let's take a look at Rin. Um, he's a hunter, so that means... Wait, how many warriors do we have? Okay, one, uh, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so seven warriors, and I do believe five archers. So if we go back, wait, one, one, two, three, uh, four, and then a mage. Um... Well, he does have to get some silver armor, not the mithril armor. <laughs> silver boots and the weaponry. We do have a silver sword for him. And we have a steel pickaxe and a steel axe. So I guess we can get to crafting some, at least a bit of tools for him. So if we go back, uh, silver axe, we can craft that for sure. Silver pickaxe, get that going. We have plenty of silver. Wait, why did I give him a silver sword when we have a yet again? Sorry, fella. <laughs> Don't take the old stuff. Take the new shiny stuff. Okay, so here's the lava again. This is the edge. Yeah, we want this gold over here. Continue in that direction, please. I guess I can do that. Okay, so that's nice. We got that. That's pretty cool. What else is in this quest book? Find a hidden room. Okay, so we'll basically do all that pretty soon, I think. Okay, so here's the bedrock, if we want to call it that from Minecraft. <laughs> we cannot go any further than that. So just stop there. Um, maybe take five blocks this way and also 
five blocks this way. It seems like they're finding their way out. Uh, oh yeah, that's... wait. That's not connected to anything. Where's he going? Um... <laughs> okay, you know what? Take that stone. Okay, or not. Hmm. Okay, we'll see what happens there. That'll be it. Wait, do not take that. Do not take that. Okay, it's just a cave. I thought the lava would be down here, but it's still pretty close, so I'm not going to go that far out. We do want this gold, though. Yeah, no mithril whatsoever. Please take three down. Ooh, minus book. Not bad. Okay. Come on, buddy. I might have to use a... Oh, the mana got restored. Okay, perfect. Okay, so... Okay, yeah. That's pretty much it. So... That's not much, unfortunately. But we did find the gold, and I do believe we have a few mithril pieces now. If we take a look, not there. So if we go to... Okay, so we have four, which means we can now make two mithril ingots, which is pretty much it. So, looks like that we are actually limited to only one set of mithril armor. I'm gonna make a portal here for those guys. I guess he will be going back. Okay. Um. Yeah, that's it. We can't actually. Oh wait, I forgot about this bit though. Okay. Um. Also, there could be some at the very edge, but it's it would be like right down here where it would be a direct drop. Um, I guess we should get this. I just want to make sure this is clear. It is indeed. Get that going. Get this. Right there. Now he woke up. <laughs> I don't want to get that one because that would let out this entire swarm. This is a pretty big and nasty room with all these guys. So, that's something we want to fiddle with right now. We're close to 100 coins, which would enable us to buy that um, mana thing, mana generator booster that I wanted to desperately get. So, yeah. There we go. I think I could take a dwarf and then place some dirt there, but you know what? It's fine. So, this is actually bringing us very close to the end of this world um yeah i'm not sure what will happen when we enter the next world we'll cross that bridge when we get there i'm not going to find out beforehand i want it to be a surprise but i don't know what will happen if we will start fresh in a new world or if we will have our materials that we have here if our dwarves will follow us i would guess so since it's a portal but will they keep those things I don't know we will have to see what happens um, yeah so that's pretty much it that's all we can do we could buy wait we could buy the um, we could buy mithril ingots but it's very expensive we would be able to like get four ingots and then we've used 60 of our coins, which is not something that I want to do. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. I hate when that happens. Dude, get back. Get back right now. Um, go eat. <laughs> okay, now close. you kidding me. You're wasting so much better, these guys. Okay, you know what? Leave it. Um, okay, so he got that. I like to leave torches behind just so I know and I can see where I've been. Get that guy. Place a portal. So, there we go. Got some of those beetles. Come on, wake up. 
Minecraft the world. Wake up. Okay, place one down there too. Okay, um, I believe this is a pretty lengthy episode, so I think I'll cut it here. And I'll just see how much uh, mithril we have and see how much we can actually make with it. Uh, let's see. So we got those two ingots. We got seven ore. Do we have any more ore? Can we buy ore? Five coins. <laughs> That's something that I really want to spend. Um, but it would give us eight, which would give us four more, which would bring us very close to another full suit. If we could get two dwarves equipped, fully equipped, that would be pretty cool. I think I'm going to cut the episode and then off camera I will be hunting these guys down here because they seem to to drop mithril sometimes. I do want to see this in action though. Hold up. Both of them came through actually. <laughs> so nice. So we'll see what happens when this guy dies. There we go. I have seen it happen like close to these. Okay, nothing there. I guess it's random. We'll try this one too. And I guess this one. Doesn't hurt. Doesn't hurt trying. We'll try. Okay, get that guy. Keep going. Hmm. Seems so random, but I see it happen like right next to them without there being a mithril ore. So I guess it's really random that around, uh, around these there will be stuff in it maybe? I don't know. Like there's iron right there. So I guess it's where they spawn when they wake up. That it could potentially have something. Not them actually dying. Because it seems like they only drop leather and slime or something. So I guess that's not worth it. Um, unfortunately. Now I do see these down here. But it's very, very close to the dragons that I do not want to be. Um, okay, that's just a zombie. <laughs> um, I just want this one last piece, you know. Right now. Okay, get that guy. Yeah, see, just meat, but he didn't drop slime though. Oh, well. Um, looks like I have to extend this portal. Actually, no. They can. Can't they? No, they actually can't. Wait, new creature. Ah. I'm used to Rimworld passing the action. New creature, dragon. No. Oh. I found them already before you told me. Okay, but I believe I will end this episode here then. Um, actually, right before I do that. Uh, control. Let me just try this. I want to see if it's possible for me to just sneak a dirt in there when there's no ants around. Like now. Nope. Wait for it. It's doable, I believe. Just have to find the right timing. Nope. I guess maybe because I'm here, they are now extra interested. Yes, perfect. Yes, it's working. <laughs> now dig this. Actually, before that, place another one here, quick. And again. Now. Perfect. Okay, now dig that. Then we should have our one mithril left. I might try and get down there to the dragons um, off camera. <laughs> um, and try and get those two last mithril pieces. But um, just because I really want them. But that will be it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, remember to leave a like, comment and share it with your friends. And if you're new to the channel, remember to subscribe. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed, and I hope to see you next time. Have a nice day.
拜拜。